Absolutely. Uh, and when you are looking for the money from outsiders, yes. better to go for society. Probably, probably, yes. Uh, it, is, it, is, it is probable except that excessive democratization can also be disastrous. You can find that there is a bunch of people who sometimes have thrown out good committees. Yes. And I have seen org good organizations die because of this. I can't name anybody, but I have seen that. I mean, I've been enough years in this sector to see the good, bad, and ugly of this sector. So I've seen really good organizations which have won awards, national awards, who wound up two years ago because of this kind of a thing where people just threw away some good guys and, and now the organization has gone to seed and it's wound up. So it has happened. Award-winning organizations. So somewhere a trust does make sense. Section 25 company also, if you are ready for compliances, if you are ready for, you know, going with the corporate flow, then it's good. I have run a Section 25 company for 25 years, so I do believe that it's, but at the same time, I've also been on boards of trusts and societies. In terms of compliance with income tax, FCRA is the same thing. The reporting procedures are different only by charity commissioner versus ROC. And compliance under ROC is 